Thanksgiving is going to the dogs. The National Dog Show, an annual tradition to watch as the turkey-itis takes over and lands you in a couch coma, is still happening this year but like most of 2020. It's going to look a little different. The Dog Show, hosted by the Kennel Club of Philadelphia annually since 1933, will go on as planned, but all the good boys and girls will compete without spectators, vendors, sponsors, or the press. The American Kennel Club, AKC, sanctioned event will see purebred dogs, accompanied by their owners, V for the coveted best in show title. Of course, the event will follow COVID-19 safety protocols, including social distancing, mask wearing and more, but NBC, which televises the event, said there will be a mere 600 dogs competing. Much less than the nearly 2,000 who typically compete in the show. While there may be fewer canines overall, there will be a few new breeds added this year for dog lovers and fanatics to fawn over. So if you prefer pooches to pigskin, football, or parades, the National Dog Show is the program for you. Here's when and where to watch, along with what to expect and everything to know before tuning in. The event will start at noon EST and run until 2 p.m. on Thursday, November 26, airing directly after the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade on NBC. Plus, the network will air an 8 to 10 p.m. repeat of the S. The venue is the Greater Philadelphia Expo Center in Oaks, PA. According to the show, only officials plus dogs and their handlers. NBC personnel and security will be permitted on the premises at the Expo Center. Fun Facts, the show, which was founded in 1879, has been held annually since 1933, but NBC's first broadcast happened less than two decades ago, in 2002. John Miller President of Programming for NBC Sports and NBC Sports Network told The Post in 2013 that Christopher Guest's beloved 2000 mockumentary Best in Show actually inspired him to air the show on a national scale. The ratings surprised everyone that first year, and it's been on the air ever since, Miller said. How in place of the postponed Ravens vs. Steelers Thursday night football game. There will be fewer dogs competing this year, down 70% from the usual number entries, the show said. However, the AKC recognizes 208 dog breeds, splitting the competition into seven different groups though not every single recognized breed will be present on the day of the show. Regardless, lots of fur will be flying as judges decide who is the top dog. Expect three new breeds this year. The Barbet, a French water dog with curly hair, will compete in the sporting group. The Belgian Lacanois will duke it out in the herding group, and the Doggo Argentino, an Argentinian pack hunting dog, will battle in the working group. The first round pits dogs of the same breed against each other, seeking the best in breed title. That winner will go on to rep their breed in one of the seven group categories sporting, hound, working, terrier, toy non-sporting and herding. Dogs competing in each group are not judged against each other, NBC explained, but instead it's all about how well they fit their breed standards. From there, the first in breed winners from each group compete in best in show to become the top winner of the national dog show. John O'Hurley and David Free, who have hosted the show since it first aired, will continue their annual duties as hosts this year. Mary Carrillo will offer commentary, analysis and behind-the-scenes at the show. Last year, Thor the Bulldog Mean mugged his way to victory, creaming the steep competition of over 2,000 dogs.